Hey everyone. So while we were on vacation, I picked up this calendar and I thought, well, let's give it a try. I'm using a 16 inch hexagon canvas and I've already put some white base coat down. Uh, the recipes for my paint mixing are below the video. The base coat as well as how we mix our bottled paints and add the silicone to the bottle. So I'm going to place this right here in the middle. It does have um, some areas where the paint will be able to come out, so that should be interesting. But I, what I, I want to do is a dirty pour in here. So my colors today are going to be just um, the white from Creative Inspirations, Titanium White. Craftsmart Midnight Blue Metallic. Uh, this is Creative Inspirations Lamp Black. Craftsmart Blue Ice Pearl. Folk Art Sapphire Metallic. I'm going to put a little bit of the Cloud White um, mix in there. Uh, Grumbacher Permanent Light Blue. Deco Art Worn Penny. This is a dark copper. And Soho Phalo Blue. So let's see how this is going to work for us. Um, I will start with a white. I'm not spraying my cup. There's enough silicone in these paints that I shouldn't need it. Craft Smart Midnight Blue. A little bit of black. That helps with the metallics. Craft Smart Blue Ice Pearl. Folk Art Sapphire Blue. And this is where we'll put a little cloud white. Grumbacher Permanent Light Blue. Deco Art Worn Penny. And Soho Phalo Blue. I think I want to just light layer of each color again. Now remember, these have silicone, so we are going to get cells. been getting caught up on orders and commission work and today we need to paint <laughs> I actually need to paint every day it just helps with stress doesn't it okay Soho phalo blue all right we've got plenty of paint here I'm gonna pinch the cup I'm going to start in the middle and work my way out because we have tons of holes here to play with Cells in the calendar. <laughs> and we have cells on the canvas. Okay. Oh, interesting. So I'm going to go ahead and lift this up, let it drip for a minute. Go ahead and start tilting. The outside edges are prettier than it, the middle, so let's see if we can stretch that middle out and see what's in there. Plenty of paint to play with, so we'll see. And I should be able to pull some great skins off of the runoff. We're going to be doing another video on the snap jewelry. I'm hoping to get that done this weekend. It's a great way to use up your runoff and make some beautiful pieces. They sell so well. Um, at craft shows 
and you can sell to your co-workers and your family and your friends. So I'm really liking this, but I want to stretch that out. The white is starting to sink, which is good. So that cloud white did give us a cool effect right in here where it was next to that blue sapphire. I think what I'm going to do is stretch that because I like the stark part here. I'm going to stretch that all the way over there. And when I start to see too much stretch, I'll come back. I think that's good right there. So that way it's a little off-centered. And it's really pretty right there. So let me torch it and see what we get. We should get some more cells. Hopefully in the areas where it's um, just plain. And when this dries, it'll be beautiful because there's so many metallics in here. And if you want to see it, just ask on Monday nights when we're live. And I'm more than happy to pull them out of the curing bin to show them. But I am going to try this calendar again, um, maybe with some reds and orange, just to see the difference in how it lays when we just pour it in. This was a dirty cup, so um, I'd like to see it layered with separ um, separated colors, just to see how it would look. But that's going to be it for this one, guys. Subscribe if you haven't already. Click on that bell for notifications, and please leave comments and share the video with your friends. Hi, Sorry about that. My phone never fails to ring in the middle of a video. <laughs> all the links below. Check all those out. Amazon for all your paint pouring supplies. Etsy for paintings. Uh, the Stone Coat Art Coat Resin Code is below. Um, this would look beautiful resined when it's finished. And also our post office box address is there if you want to send a gadget for us to play with. Ellen is always game and sometimes I am too. <laughs> but thanks so much for watching guys and we'll see you all on the next one. Bye now.